What's up everybody and welcome back to our at home dumbbell workout. Today we have a dumbbell and jump rope workout for you, but don't worry, if you don't have a jump rope, I'm gonna show you some alternatives you can do in place of them. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Hudson and my goal is to help you become more functional and fit. So if you enjoy this video and want to see more just like it, hit that like button and subscribe. Also, before you jump into today's workout, check the description down below for a six minute follow along warm up video you can do prior to this workout to make sure your body is warmed up and prepped for all the exercises we have in today's workout. Now we're gonna get started in a second. First, let's break down the structure of this workout as well as the exercises. So for today's workout, you have an 18 minute window. Within that 18 minutes, you're gonna try to complete three rounds of different exercises. And if you get those three rounds done prior to the 18 minutes, then the remaining time, you're gonna do max burpees. So let's break down those different rounds and those exercises. So the first round, you're gonna do 75 jump rope, followed by 10 doubles press and 10 Kazakh squats, and then come back to jump rope the second round, 75, 20, 20, third round, 75, 30, 30. So the reps go up every time, it gets spicy, so be a little reserved at the beginning so you can have a little bit of energy going into the second and third round. Now first for the jump rope, if you're able to do single unders or double unders, awesome. If you have any other kind of style of jump rope you like to do, perfect. You're just gonna count each jump as 75 reps total. If you don't have a jump rope, you're gonna do either jumping jacks in place of it, or double the amount of high knees. So getting your hands at horizontal, getting your knees to touch your hands, these are actually a lot harder than people typically think. So I challenge you, if you haven't done high knees before and you don't have a jump rope available, do the high knees option and you will be crushed by the end of this workout. Next for the devil's press. You want the dumbbells wide enough so your chest is gonna fit in the middle. You're gonna grab the handles, do a burpee style push up. From here, land with your feet behind the dumbbells. You're gonna have your chest up, hike it in your hips, pop overhead, bring it back to the hips, back to the floor, right in your next rep. The goal is to use as much hips and leg drive as you possibly can, even though your back and your arms will work a little bit, make your lower half do as much of the work as possible. Once you've gotten 10 reps of those done, then you have 10 Kazakh squats. So for these, just grab one dumbbell, have a wide stance with the legs, a lot wider than shoulders width, go down as low as you can one side, come back up, switch to the other side, back up, so you're doing five each leg. All right guys, good luck and have fun with this workout. Hopefully I don't die. It's currently 94 degrees in SoCal and my garage definitely doesn't make it any cooler. So hopefully we make up the 18 minutes still breathing. All right, you guys, here we go. Starting in five, three, two, one, 75 jump ropes. Whew. All 
right, on to round two. 75 and then 20 and 20. that I'm broken. Try to keep it as short as possible.
20. Oh man. Ooh. Can't wait for the 30s. Almost halfway, we're at eight minutes now. slowing down now. So I have 15 done, 15 more to go. Oh man. All right, another set of eight. We're at 12 minutes. We got six more minutes to go, you guys. Try to get to the burgers, everything you got.
I'm gonna go to 10 and take a break. I got two more. team. We got four minutes left. Cossack squats are going to be fast. All right, five more. Once you get to the last set of Cossack squash, try to go unbroken. your own burpees. If you're close, push hard so you can get one burpee in. Oh. Oh. 
Awesome job on that workout today, you guys. I think that might have been the hardest at-home dumbbell workout I've programmed to date. Before you wrap it up and call it a day, be sure to check out the follow-along stretch routine videos I have posted here because you want to make sure your body is loosened up and ready for your next at-home dumbbell workout. And on top of that, check the description down below for discounts on my favorite fitness products if you guys want to support the channel. Thanks so much for joining me today, guys. I'll see you in the next video.